called Twin World. So we have come across many types of subjects like financial topic, financial planning and types of financing, like mentoring, especially in a career mentor. So this time we gonna analyze and watch, study and learn about these popular topics called Certified Public Accountant, which is equivalent with Chartered Accountant in India. So let's move in. Let's move in to know more details about what does it impact. Certified Public Accountant, what does it really mean and what is the placement, the job wise. and prospects about after completing this course. Now we are in the introduction part. CPL, the full form is Certified Public Accountant, which is we are going to present. I hope and guess that many of us know about this Certified Public Accountant. Uh, they know very well about this since it's very popular in US, Australia and many countries and go, it is a globally recognized course. And they are a lot and in India also we have Chartered Accountant CA, so it's equivalent with this CPA, Certified Public Accountant. CPA is Certified Public Accountant is that the highest accounting credential in the US. CPA, Certified Public Accountant is the highest accounting credential, accounting credential in the US. CPA, <clears throat> I'm sorry, which exactly we're talking about is CPA Certified Public Accountant is equivalent, equivalent with which we already know that CA, which means Charter Accountant in India. So they call this CPA Certified Public Accountant is Charter Accountant in USA, the United States of America. And CPA is another advantage, which is the highest accounting credential. The highest Accounting credential, the, the highest accounting credential in US and abroad. And certified public accountant ensures that it is globally recognition which has a lot of advantage especially for job seeking students after they pass what after they graduated from this cpa course then they don't have they don't have to worry about seeking the jobs so they place placement sales is in a hurry to get them Sorry, global recognition. Globally recognized. This is the main advantage 
and short after course. Many all passed on after this course. What exactly it impact in the fields of as we know that accounting accounting let me roll in short form accounting and finance it is the main areas which related aspects so this is in short i define that cpa certified public accountant is equivalent with chartered accountant in india so they know cpa certified public accountant in us as designated as chartered accountant in us and it is the highest accounting credential in US and abroad, Australia, etc. And the starting salary, the basic salary, the fresher salary is quite high. And it is globally recognized. So you don't have to face any kinds of job, pro uh, job problem aspects if you complete that if you studied and graduated this course very well and it is mainly in the fields of accounting and finance right so let's move on to the another arena In this YouTube channel, I'll make it to be more precise for you, like mentoring career avenue. So after this, we are going to cover SCCA and CMA. Then maybe later after a month like that. So we're going to cover that CWM let's adventure their official site which is you at most need at that so I'm gonna provide at the description link so you don't have to worry about that you just and look into the official website and uh, see there are lots of lots of informations if you want to join the course and like fees salary and what it is benefits what beneficial advantage and disadvantage too so I think we don't have to discuss this about eligibility requirement okay So, to join this certified public account, then the first thing is that you have to graduate. That means after passing class 10, you have to do class 2, then again class 3. This is graduation course, and this is 10 plus 2, and this is 10. So if you completed this course, you can join it. There's no entrance examinations like management aptitude test, IM, IIM test, IITJE test. So you can join it. It doesn't mean that if you have 
uh, higher education qualification like master degree, postgraduate, doctorate degree. You can join it. You can join it, of course. It's more better than that. That is the minimum qualification. Minimum qualification to enter to join the CPA course, right? As I already said, that CPA certified public accountant in US is equivalent with charter accountant in India. So in US, they call certified public accountant, or they designated certified public accountant as a charter accountant. So do you remember that? Okay. Where is their headquarter? Headquarter, they call this AIC, AICPA. AICPA. That means American Institute of Certified Public Accountant, right? And in 1818, in 1887, they formed this institution and it is located at uh, Durham North Carolina Durham North Carolina US This is the headquarter of certified public certified public content institution the prestigious institution is located at Durham, North Carolina, United States. Okay. I think we can move again. So that's all about introduction about what actually what does it implies certified public accountant, where is the headquarter located and eligibility requirement. That means you have to pass at least graduation course and their official official website is later on I'll put at that uh, description link and CPA certified public accountant in US is equivalent with charter accountant in India. And certified public accountant is the highest accounting credentials and it is globally recognized. So there's no pops, there's no problem about job seeking for students or those who are passing out, right? <clears throat> now we are at examination details course duration the course duration the exam is divided in four parts and the course duration is between the course duration is between twelve to sixteen months, right? The course duration is between twelve to sixteen months, so it's it's damn short, but it's not. 
really easy to get to that. It's really tough to get to. So you must be hardworking student or you must be hardworking executive uh, to carry on this course, prestigious course, right? The main subject of this course, the first one is accounting and attestation. I told you that there are four subjects before and the second one is business environment business and very wrong man maybe called business method The third one is regulation. You can get all these things in the borders at the design aid official site, which I'm going to put at description link. And the last one is financial accounting financial accounting and reporting okay financial accounting and reporting here business environment business environment and concepts concepts okay this is the main subject which you have to go to during the entire course during the entire course so you have to pass out to pass out and to complete certified public accountant you have to go through all these four subjects roughly understand very well and write effectively at the time of examination. Board of examination. What, which contact the examination? So the exam is conducted by as I told you that AI AICPA that is American Institute of Certified Public Accountant. Let me write okay. American in Institute of Certified Public Accountant. This American Institute of Certified Public Accountant conduct the examination and grades the examination pool. And grade the examination tool. So you may wonder about that. Can I study from India? Of course, you can study from India. There are affiliated uh, institute. They run in most of the stage which you're gonna get at the brochures 
which I'm going to tell, I'm going to tell you at the, I'm going to provide you at the link at description link. You don't have to worry about joining the course if you are really interested and enthusiastic. Targets to achieve. Targets to achieve means how to get to, how to get past in simple, in simple meaning. To pass or to get to these all four sections. To be able to classify you as a graduate, a graduate of this course, you have to pass, you have to pass all four subjects which I already mentioned. Within 18 months, if you are brilliant enough, then you can complete between 12 16 to, but this is the duration, the actual duration that okay, you have to pass four subjects within 18 months before that, too. If you are excellent and if you are built, um, brilliant enough then you can come you could you could do that along with that you could you must score a scale there is a scale a scale the a scale that ranges a scale that ranges from zero to ninety nine okay so you must score at least seventy five here this is the bound from 0 to 99, you have scored at least 75. Minimum, this is minimum. Okay. You have to score at least 75 in each of the subjects which we have mentioned. I hope that everything is clear. So let me repeat once again. <coughs> Certified public accountant, the, the course duration is between 12 to 16 months. And uh, papers are four papers. And the first one is accounting and attestation. And the second one is business, environment, and concepts. And third one is regulations. And fourth one is financial accounting and reporting. And certified public account and examination is conducted by American Institute of Certified Public Account and, and which have uh, the authority to grade the examinations and to pass four subjects within, uh, within uh, 18 months, not beyond 18 months, within 18 months. And before that, also, if you are brilliant enough and if you are really hardworking person, then you can you can do that, you can give the examination and if you clear then that's it's up to you and there is a scale that ranges from 0 to 99 and the minimum score mark is 75, right? Let's move. Up till now, I think everything is clear. What is recommended study hours? 
study your words is depend it depends on you it's your vital level and it's your energy level but in this case in case of certified public accountant there are recommended study hours so let me write so you, you can get in the details a total of one k one thousand hours of study including sunday so there's no real day including sunday if you are really willing to get through this course and get done well so there's no real day for you even sunday even Sunday time, you have to work very hard, exactly same as another day. It's spread over approximately, it's spread over approximately 12 months. So, as per the authority or the regulations of the American Institute of Certified Public Accountant, there is a rules to follow the documented study awards. So, you have to go through this if you want to study and excel and get to the course. So a total of 1,000 hours of study, including Sunday, which spread over approximately 12 months. So the course duration is between 12 to 16 months. So the whole duration, the whole duration of the course, it implies that. The fish, if you want to get something, you have to pay it. If you want to get OT enough, then you have to pay more. So let me write in short form that total exam fees, total exam fees for four exams uh, per section. That is, okay, let me write, okay. Total exam fees. That means uh, four papers. Four papers is US dollar two fifty in Indian rupees seventy three k. And there is another fees, international testing fee, international testing fees, right? This also in terms, uh, in this case also that's four papers, okay, four four exams. In Indian rupees, one like ninety one leg like ninety five hundred. One leg like ninety five hundred. Okay. This is also called evaluation fees. Evaluation fees. 
one leg 9500 is called evaluation fees and this 73k is international testing fees so i hope it's clear that we can move it Salary matters a lot. While choosing the course or while choosing the, the while doing the graduation or post graduation or uh, PhD level, how much can I earn after passing out? What is the placement sale? Is there a job guarantee? So salary is the highest factor. So now i'm going to give you that the basic salary fresher salary those who are passing now the fresher salary right the park is different in india and foreign so let's talk about in india first you must remember that for the fresher basic salary in india the fresher earns about six six lakhs per annum in india that means six lakhs per annum means 50k 50 50k per month which is not bad enough that is minimum salary okay this is minimum minimum salary so in us the fresher arms this i converted in jan rupees rupees nine point something 9.25 lakhs per month. So in US, here I'm gonna put. Uh, it's okay. We can put later on that. Another countries like Canada, Australia. So in India, the fresher, those, those who are passing out uh, originally, fresher on six lakhs per annum, uh, that is equal to 50K per month. And in US, the fresher on nine point something lakhs per annum. So most of the grads, most uh, most of the students who are passing out or who pass out certified public accountant course, their job title. I'm gonna give you only one this one CFO. You know that what is CFO? CFO, you know, CFO is chief. Chief Financial Officer. We know that CEO, CFO, etc. The main job title I'm gonna give you later on. So I think no need to discuss much about at this time. So let me repeat once again. So American Institute of Certified Public Accountant has rules and regulations that must be followed. So there is a recommended study awards, a total of 1,001k hours of study including some data spread over approximately 12 months. And the fees is total 
fees, total fees, uh, total exam fees that uh, including that four papers, four subjects, which we already discussed about that. So international testing fees, dollar two fifty, which is equivalent in Indian rupees seventy three k seventy three thousand, and evaluation fees in Indian rupees one lakh ninety five hundred. So the pressure those who are passed out and get job instantly and the basic salary in India is six lakhs per annum, uh, which is fifty k per month. That is minimum salary. In US they earn rupees nine point two two five lakhs per annum. Okay, so the job title they get. The highest one maybe is CFO, that is Chief Financial Official. Everything has the, the bright side and the dark side. Everything has the dark side and the bad side. Just like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. So, certified public account and this of course it's a prestigious course and it's show doctor course and it's really popular job, popular course across global. But it has the dark side. The first one is demand. Demand. What demand is it? There are there are lots of demand from the clients. Okay. There are lots of demands from the clients maybe various factors what kinds of demands expectation status maybe job factors boring how how come you can say that it's boring it's really good job, it's really a nice job, and it's really a sort of first job. But it's still boring sometimes. As we said that everything has both sides. Boring in terms of Reputation. Boring in terms of reputation, okay? And we don't know. In terms of sedentary. Sedentary work environment. Sedentary work environment. Lots of stressful work, continuing job, and non stop. There are various factors. Stress, of course, stress is really stressful sometimes, even though. We have or you have a good job, stress level is too high. When the status is too high, the stress the stress level is too high. When your job is the profile of clerk or maybe low profile, stress level is not that much, okay? 
it's really impact. We all understood that. So the advantage, of course, we already discussed about this salary. Their basic salary is in India also that rupees six six lakhs per annum. That is basic salary for fresher salary. In details, that is minimum salary. Of course, salary is good. No need to worry about for putting investment in mutual fund equity, stock market. There are a lot of unattended savings. Right? White. After passing out certified public account and calls, you don't have to worry about the jobs. The jobs will seek you and there are wide variety of jobs. You can choose the jobs you like, the job you favor. Work. You have an opportunity to flexible work and learning, continuous learning. In certified public account and after you passing out also you have to handle many types of reporting, accounting job and uh, you can still have an option to learn something new. Okay. Learn something new opportunities. Right. So Everything has the bright side and dark side as certified public accountant do. So the cons is the demands. A lot of demands from the clients maybe, from the job factors maybe, the exposure maybe, and boring. It's quite boring sometimes when you uh, hold help a desire opposed to and env environment, sedentary work environment and stressful sometimes when demanded job and demanded profile you hold and salary is quite high the minimum pay is 6 lakhs per annum if you work in domestic and if you work abroad it, it's higher than domestic one and you have an opportunity to work in a flexible, a flexible work schedule and you have an opportunity to learn something new along with your job and you have various opportunities, wide opportunities of jobs and you can choose and you can work on that job. Industry It's in industry it's rapidly increasing, rapidly increasing, or rapidly growing, growing industries. Growing industry. Okay. I hope everything is clear so we can move. Oh, education. Education is as 
we all knew that it's tough and it's costing to to pursue this type of uh, sought after course and demand co demanded job demanded course so you have to pay a lot for your education and mentally and financially right so you can advance main jobs after completing certified public accountant last time i already clear out that c cfo chief financial chief financial official chief financial official What is FD? FD simply implies that finance director it means that the main jobs after completing certified public accounting course you, you can be in a position or you can hold this title job okay cc cc simply implies corporate controller corporate controller The job status is not that much, but it's really reputable job, high status, and ASD. ASDE, A4 accounting, S4 accounting software developer counting software developer right there are lots of jobs you can join you can work on that but i'm just taking out a few examples Senior Financial Analyst Senior Financial Analyst Right? Senior Financial Analyst So uh, these are the five uh, job titles I'm taking out uh, to get yeah, in-depth details about what actually is Certified Public Account and, and uh, what they hold in the eyes of the public society so prestigious jobs titles of course I hope that everything is clear and new chat. So, as I told you that in this channel, I came across and I produce various bits relating to financial topics and wealth topics and business issues, investment, mutual funds, stock market, anything that. So you can ask anything in the feedback form i mean that uh, comment section like career mentoring so we cover i've covered and i'm gonna cover in the future to uh, 
and more oranges. So thank you for watching and being with me this time. Thanks a lot. Thanks, guys.